How you doing, YouTube? It's Anthony with my reef. This is just a small update. Anybody who knows about this, True Temp, is not a great digital controller. This thing really sucks. I, om I almost lost, I don't have that much coral, but I almost lost whatever I had plus my fish. This thing will boil your tank. So thanks to Nectum Apex, I saved whatever stock that I had. Uh, I've been away for a month or so. I was out of the country, so my tank, I leave, I leave by myself, my tank is pretty much uh, alone in the house. I don't got nobody to, uh, to watch my tank. The only person I can count on is my daughter, but she doesn't know much about fish and stuff. So, uh, thanks to uh, Neptune Apex, I kind of like keep my eye in my uh, tank condition when I'm away, using my app through my phone. So, about uh, last week, I noticed the temperature in my tank was kind of rising. And I know it's July, I know the weather is warm and stuff. But from, I always try to keep my tank 77 and I have a, chi a chiller connected to my sump. And my chiller is bigger than my, cap uh, my water capacity in my tank. So my chiller can do up to one 170 gallons and my tank is 120, counting the sump, you say about, about 130, it's 130 gallons. So, like I said, I was through my uh, Neptune Apex app. I was checking my tank, you know, do my 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 regular routine to see if every everything is running the way it's supposed to be. I noticed my temperature was going going up, so I called my daughter and asked my daughter to go to my house, and she did. And uh, when she got home, she kept on. I told her to check my True Life. I love iPhone. This live shot is perfect. So through life, I started checking my, my temperature and my heat and stuff like that. One of my heaters, I turned my, the heater off through my Apex. I got two heaters. Each one is 500 watts. I got one connected to my Apex, Neptune Apex, and the other one I connected to, uh, to the digit controller. This one right here. I like to keep it separate to have better, you know, to have better control with my heating system. So, like I was saying, I noticed through the light shot, my my tank was almost, it was like 90 degrees, close to 90 degrees. And the screen on the digital controller was saying low, L-O. It had no numbers, L-O. So I told my daughter to unplug it for me. I unplugged it and everything. And behold, the temperature went down and my tank went back to 77 degrees. Thanks to my daughter, you know, and thanks to uh, Nectum Apex, I think Nectum Apex is one of the best uh, units they ever done for this uh, hobby. So I got back a couple of days ago and, you know, I started doing my regular maintenance and stuff like that. Do my small water changes, clean it. I decided to turn off my pump and just connect. I got three compartments in my sump. Refugian, protein schema, heater, compartment, and my pump. So I turned off the water pump and I just skipped and I turned the heater on in my middle compartment with the protein schema. To figure out what was the problem with the digital controller. So I noticed in 20 minutes, my water from 77 went up to 110. When I put my hand inside the tank, it burned my fingers. That's how hot the water got. And and I much I tried to figure out what was the problem with this uh, with this unit, I couldn't find no nothing wrong with it. I couldn't find no damages or nothing. So I called the company. I asked the company about this problem, and they said to me, "Get the only thing they could have done for me is replace the digital control for another one." They were charging me, I think, 25 bucks for it, at discount price. 
the ins I didn't know the guarantee in this unit only lasts six months. My unit was past six months, so it couldn't cover by the company. So they asked me, they would send me a replacement part and charge me 25 bucks for it. And I asked the guy if that's gonna fix my problem, and he couldn't give me no guarantee. So I'm not gonna, I, I decided not, not to buy it. I told him no. I'm not gonna get this unit again to this 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 uh, uh, problem happens again it's gonna kill my fish there's too much money invest in this hobby very expensive especially I love my 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 animals my fish are like dogs to me like dogs and cats to some people this to me they're my dogs to me they're my cats so I love my fish and I can and I can't afford having things like this they're not gonna they're not gonna work properly and eventually you have a disaster and you lose all your stock no so i say i said no i decided to uh purchase another uh digital controller because i like to keep my heater separate i got two of them one i keep it to my neptune and one i keep it separate from the neptune so i bought another heater to bulk uh bulk re uh, supply that had it for 40 bucks uh ink bird temperature pro so i got this the other day let me show you it's working properly it's giving me the temperature of my my water 77.0 and uh it's working great right now so my sheila my chiller is working properly even though it says 79 you should keep Two, uh, two degrees higher but my water 77 got it right there so now my heating uh, my heating my heat is working properly so I keep I kept the titanium heater I kept that connected to the new digital controller because it was working it was working it was doing their job this thing wasn't working so I did some reviews on the internet to see if other people had the problem, a lot of people had this problem with this thing. This thing, after four months, stopped working. It will heat up your water, and the point the water will actually boil. This thing will boil your fish. And I pay a lot of money. I don't want to say name of the company that I bought it from. I bought it on the internet. I don't want to say no name because I never had problems with them before. So I'm not blaming them. I'm blaming the manufacturer, whoever built this. This thing is dangerous. It will kill your fish or it can hurt somebody. The water will literally boil. I when I put my hand inside, not even 20 minutes, I put my hand inside the tank, I burn my fingers. That's how hot the water was. And it's lucky I didn't melt my protein skimmer. So I recommend it. If you're gonna buy a, a digital controller for your tank to, to, to help your precious stock you pressure fish don't get this this thing it's a time bomb i hate it and i wouldn't recommend it to nobody true temp titanium heating system it sucks it should have said true garbage professional crap so i hope this video can help any and you know whoever's trying to look for a digital controller I hope uh, this helped you and decide not to get this, get something else. So I just want to say peace and have a nice day, guys.